people go missing around here, they're gone for good. You do realize this camp was closed down like 20 years ago. Potato! Welcome, boys and girls, and all the new people to the Pataman Army to a brand new short horror movie reaction. Recently we just reacted to one with Freddy and Harry Potter mixed together and today we are reacting to one with Jason and Batman mixed together. So two of the biggest badasses in film history where you got Jason who never got damn toys and you got Batman who through the years he went from being cool to being cheesy to being a badass to being a pussy. So We'll see how he fares against Jason. But you guys absolutely love the Freddy and Harry Potter videos, so thank you guys so much for that. And also later out tonight, we're going to have another video out um, just explaining what's coming to the channel. But before we get into this video, if you could smash that like button, hit that subscribe button, and join the Patatman Army, because I think about over 90% of the channel ain't subscribed of the watchers. So if you're new to the channel and you're enjoying the stuff hit that subscribe button it supports me and it helps me get more videos out to you guys but yeah like i said batman and jason this is once again from the form lunchbox so i'll leave their link down below in the description and uh yeah let's get into it and see who wins the fight between batman and jason good old red background again there's an old camp just outside of Gotham, somewhere called Crystal Lake. So if someone spelled all that in Gotham, I'm of it. Boy drowned there about 40 years ago. They say he never dies. People go missing around here, they're gone for good. You do realize this camp was closed down like 20 years ago. <laughs> I like that, Jason. He was a badass. Jason Voorhees is dead. No, he's not. Jason never does. The mere mention of the name Jason Voorhees, he has been responsible for 83 confirmed murders. No one goes in there till we know what actually down. imagine Batman doing this. Has been enough to send a shudder of fear through the hearts of an entire nation. Gotham's time has come. Be safe out there, Master Wayne. Hmm? Fucking that's number eight, isn't it, in the Manhattan? God damn! Now, now, people. There's no need to worry. He brought another man into the axe wound. I'm the only one that can stop him now. I have no limits. Just don't show Val Kilmer's Batman on my phone. Or George Clooney's. This is it, though. Jason would wreak havoc on fucking Gotham. Oh. They're showing Val Kilmer. <laughs> what? So, he wouldn't use a gun like that, he'd use a taser. Jason and this boy Batman, they in for a rumble. They're ready for a rumble in the jungle. I liked that until they show him fucking Val Kilmer's Batman. Val Kilmer and George Clooney, I hated as Batman. The only thing I enjoyed from Val Kilmer's Batman was um, Tommy Lee Jones, Two Face, and Jim Carrey as Riddler. That was it. They were the only ones who made that movie good, but. You got Val Kilmer's Batman who fucking, I think he started the back nipples and then you got George Clooney with the back cards and it's like, mate, you've just revealed yourself that you're Bruce Wayne, you're rich as fuck. But yeah, I reckon Jason will fucking push Batman to his limits, but Christian Mayo's Batman and Mark Keaton's Batman can stand a chance, but the other two Batmans, no, no. 
I'll, I'll tell you why that put bloody Val Kilmer's Batman in there. It's Cabal Baskin's fault. It's, everything is Cabal Baskin's fault. <laughs> but yeah, um, I enjoyed that. Like I said, I like the mix of uh, the J. I've, I've loved every Jason in the movies, or not Batman, but every Jason to me has had different similarities or in the newish one in the latest remake um he was a lot quicker compared to his old self where he just walked through everything smashed through everything he was a lot quicker and a lot more human like so that made him a bit more scary a bit on mock minds but yeah how who do you think would win between batman and jason i reckon batman would end up getting like some mechanical fucking suit and just Stomping his head into the ground, but then Jason will come back with futuristic technology because that's how Jason works. But me, Jason's got my vote because horror stomps out any other genre, in my opinion. So don't go crazy about that. But yeah, this was another horror reaction. Hope you guys did enjoy it. Um, you guys have been helping support the channel for a while now and I'm glad to be coming back with this sort of content for you guys but if you did enjoy this video definitely go and check out the form lunchbox on loads and loads more of these sort of videos we're going to have another one coming out tomorrow reacting to a short horror movie called 5 minute dating so we're going to check that one out tomorrow so make sure you hit that subscribe button and notification bell to get notified when that is uploaded and i'm going to have another video out later tonight just explain a few things that is coming to this channel and maybe another one so that's just a small hint but i've been dominating spud i love you tight man army and don't forget to stay starchy